Okay, today we have a Samsung Galaxy Core Prime. This model is a G360 T1, the Metro PCS variant. And today we're going to be removing the Google Factory Reset Protection Lock. Alright, just to show you guys that it is actually Google locked. Alright, so here it's basically telling you that the device was reset. You have to sign in with a Google account that was previously on this device. Can't get past this. Alright, so anybody that doesn't remember their Google account or doesn't have any other way to recover the password, then this will help you. Alright, so we're going to go back to the welcome screen and tap emergency call. Alright, we're going to dial an emergency number. In your country, it might be 911. In my country, it's actually 119. So I'm going to dial that. Alright, once the call is activated, we're going to swipe over to Internet. Chrome. Alright, now that we're in Chrome, we're going to browse to my website, M-A-L-C-O-M-P uh, P.webs.com That's the website. Go. <coughs> Alright, from here we're going to go to factory FRP bypass tools, it's right up there. From here we're going to go to the FRP bypass tool, down there. Then we're going to hit the download button. Take us to media fire where we will then download the file. seeing anything so I'm gonna try again. Okay, I guess it just finished downloading. We're gonna open the file once it's downloaded. Package installer just once or always whichever one you want. We're gonna have to Enable unknown sources. Allow this installation. I'm going to install. All 
right, open. I'm gonna install the account manager for 5.0. done bypass FRP browser sign in I'm gonna hit these three dots up here go to browser sign in okay all right now you're gonna enter your Gmail account that's your Gmail email address Alright, now we're going to restart. We're going to go through the setup. telling us that the account we just added is ready for use which means it should be good go so if I helped you to get back into your phone just please like and subscribe thank you